all right guys so the realtor guy just called me well he emailed me actually and i was just literally checking my email and he said that he wanted to meet up with me to see the space so i'm on my way to go see a space in cherry hill um new jersey which is a pretty good area as well um but yeah y'all i'm excited to see this space like hopefully it's not like super expensive and you know hopefully everything works out um the space i was looking at in my laurel was 900 a month which is super good um the space that i'm currently in right now is 1700 a month so obviously i want to pay less than 1700 a month so we can get you know we can get on track then cool um basically everything is pretty clean i just have to throw my food out oh i have to get the oh actually i was going to say i already the laptop together but i never even took it out because i didn't use it today I'm on my way to go see the suite in Cherry Hill. It is oh, Jesus. It's seven minutes from um, our current location, which is good. First of all, let me put my seatbelt on, y'all. Like, what, what am I doing? I thought I put it on, but I didn't. It's nobody coming anyway. Um. Continue straight, then use the right lane to take a slight right turn right onto lane. Route 73 South toward Haddonfield. Um. Anyways, so Continue. I just hope it's not too far from my clients because I don't want to keep moving. I said moving. I don't want to keep moving farther out, farther out, farther out. You know what I'm saying? I just, I don't want to do that and then like lose clients, you know? So, I'm trying to figure it out, y'all. I really don't know what I want to do. I really don't know what I want to do. But, I'm obviously, I'm going to go see the space and, you know, go from there. If I like it, then that might be where we you know, end up at, but we'll see. Let's see if they can get even a lease done in a week because I highly doubt it. I'm about to be there. Literally, I'm like about to pull up. So I will see y'all in a few. I might show y'all show y'all the space. I might not show y'all the space. I don't really know. He's showing me three of them. So I'll see whichever one looks best. And you know, the side from there, but I'll check y'all in a few. At the light, turn right onto church. I just came from looking at the suite and oh, excuse me. Is this it? No, it's not. Um he showed me two like he had three suites. Um and he was basically saying like do I need an office? Um, like room and stuff and I said yeah I do and he said um, that one of the suites they didn't have a, like a room it was just like an open floor plan and um, he was just like I'm just not going to show you that one because you just say you know you need a room so I was like okay cool like that's fine he said it's two other ones and that he was going to show me those ones so I was like all right you know like that's fine or whatever um so he ended up showing me 
um, before I leave. He ended up showing me um, two suites. So the first suite he showed me, I literally fell in love with the suite. Um, it's somewhat similar to the suite we have now, but it's smaller, which is perfect, y'all. Like, I literally seen all my stuff in that daggone suite, y'all. Like, no lie. But I'm about to go home right now. I'm gonna show hubby the pictures because if that's one thing about me, y'all, I'm gonna talk to my husband before I make any decision. And y'all can ask him, like, before I make any decision, I always talk to him because sometimes I make decisions like real quick, you know, without thinking. So I always like to include him in my decisions. And plus that's my husband. So good morning guys. Welcome back to another vlog. So I'm currently leaving my house right now because I'm on my way to the shop. Um, Aiden has a doctor's appointment today at 12. So I only have two clients today. I have a fill at 8.30 and then I have a um, full set at 9.30. So I'm hoping to be done by 11 so that we can make it to his appointment. His appointment is, um, he goes to like CHOP, the Children's Hospital in Philadelphia. Um, that's not his, like, primary doctor. He just goes there, you know, like, for certain checkups and stuff like that. But that's what we're doing today. Um, so that's about, like, 20 to 25 minutes from my job. So, um, yeah, that's the plans for today. Um, so it's going to be a pretty chill day, y'all. Like, you know regular schmegler day but i'm really excited you guys um over the last couple days because i haven't vlogged it's the 24th right now so i haven't vlogged in a couple days um because you guys know i go to school and all that good stuff but um the past um couple days have been I'm sorry, y'all, there was a cop. Y'all know every time a cop come around, I'm like, oh, the, 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 the. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all, it's too early. But anyway, um, so the past couple, why are so many cops over here? I don't understand. Um, so the past couple days, y'all, I've been getting orders and um, people have been booking for the class. So I'm so, so, so excited. Um, our class is March 5th. And the cutoff date is March, I mean, I'm sorry. The cutoff date is February 26th. Um, so I'm really excited. And I'm really excited too, y'all, because that suite that I want to go see, I'm obviously um, gonna take it. Really excited. So I have to be out of my suite in four days, y'all, like four days, like, these past couple days are about to like be freaking crazy but it's gonna be crazy y'all but we are gonna make it work um and you know do what we gotta do because we really don't have a choice <laughs> but it's just the thought of moving like the u-haul and like child that's too much it's just gonna be me and my husband because all my family, they live so far. They're like 40 minutes out. And plus they work and stuff. So we're moving out on Monday. So everybody has work. It's just like a whole mess, y'all. It's a whole mess. It's really a whole mess. But we gonna get it situated. I need to get in front of this truck. It's perfect. But um, yeah, guys, so we need to start packing little, little by little. So like even today, like my husband is home because it has an appointment. We always go to his appointments, me and him together. Sometimes he's not allowed to come in the room, but he waits outside. Like, you know that he's there. You get what I'm saying? He's never missed one of his appointments before. So that's just how we do. Even his ultrasound, he was never in the room, but he always waited like outside in the car. So he always came with me. It's just what we do until they lift it. 
that he can start coming in and obviously he will be there this last one he was at when we was at um chop like a couple months ago he was actually allowed in the room so he'll be allowed in the room today but it's just like his primary doctor like they be OD at some time um but anyways so ugh, i forgot what i was saying y'all i hate when i do that i begin off track so fast um i forget what i was saying oh so he's home with him and i was telling him yesterday like i feel like you should come with me to the shop like because his mom is there and y'all know his mom watch aiden so i'm like you need you know i feel like you should come to the shop both of them so that we can just leave from the shop and go straight to his appointment but um i know that he don't really like waiting up there but i was telling him like we have to pack you know so like you can start packing the little stuff like little by little and just start getting everything together like starting a room or like you know what i'm saying just little stuff and my clients like today i have a new client so In this video, we are moving. As you guys can see, it's super empty in here. We only have a few more things left, but for the most part, it's empty, y'all. So, um, we gotta come back and get this stuff because it can't fit in the U-Haul. But I am leaving. Um, I had two clients this morning and they were actually pretty okay with the fact that it was like a complete mess. Um, but yeah, I'm just locking the door. My wax pot. I don't know where my um tripod is. I'm just using my hand right now to hold everything. <laughs> um, but we're on our way right now to the new suite. I'm gonna give y'all a tour of the new suite, obviously, but I'll check y'all when we get there or get there. All right, y'all, so I just got here. This is like, the waiting area <laughs> you know i'm a straight youtuber out here mailboxes <sighs> y'all gonna have to figure it out y'all gonna have to just figure it out <laughs> what well these steps <sighs> it's only three did you talk to him no. I didn't talk to him. Because he said talk he was going to be here. I'm out of breath, y'all. Oh, my gosh. Well, it's blocked. What do you say? He's dropping the keys. All right, y'all. So let's try this again. Y'all will not believe what happened. It's 6 o'clock. It was 2 o'clock when I came and I'm just getting the keys. It's a freaking mess. 
gonna give y'all, look, all my stuff is out here. Cause I'm just getting keys. I'll give y'all a quick tour. Oh, typical me. All right, guys. This is this new suite. It's so much bigger, but it looks more on camera. Are you serious? It's the sweet guys in the break room. Sorry guys, um, this is our setup as of right now. My tripod from, or not tripod, but um, the thing for the car, like to hold my phone from five and below, that thing broke y'all. It literally broke. Um, so now I have no, um, phone holder for the car, which sucks. Like, I hate this angle. It's just a horrible angle. Um, but yesterday, so like, it's a whole nother day. Um, yesterday was crazy. It did not go as planned. Um, I got the U-Haul Sunday and returned the U-Haul yesterday, which was Saturday. Um, but I had to pay uh, I think I paid like $90. It was just a mess, y'all. It was a freaking mess. Um, hold on, it's a little jump, a little loop thing. It was a mess, y'all. Um, so yesterday, our plan was, um, the landlord was supposed to leave the keys in the suite, right? Um, and then y'all saw that clip too, when I went to the door, it was locked and it was around 2 p.m. So he's basically saying, that I had to give him the business insurance and it was a whole mess of that. I'm gonna tell y'all later, but oh wait, I'm oh, not again. Yesterday, um I didn't we didn't get the keys till like 5 30. Um and by that time the people who was helping us had to leave because it was so late already. We didn't do anything really yesterday. We just moved everything in and um, we left. And we had eight until he was like cranky. So we had to leave and we have a choice. Get this situated. I'm literally wearing the same thing from yesterday because my work clothes are like my comfort clothes. So if I wanna be comfortable or whatever, and if I'm not even working, I still wear my work shirt because this is branding, okay? Period. So I still be wearing my, you know, my work stuff, even if I'm not working. So, um, I'm about to set this bed up. But, I'm going to make this bed higher because, hold up, y'all. few other things getting delivered over the next couple days. So, um, I got some trays. Some trays, so these are all 0 0.03 in a D curl mix. So these ones, one, two, three, four, five, six. So I got six of these. Okay. And whatever is this? Oh, tweezers. Tray 0.03 D mix. 
And then I got some iPads. I already have some of most of this stuff, so that's why it's not in like big bulks. But these are the tweezers. I don't know why they did this. Oh, but this is cute. What? Look at this. These are the kit bags that I was going to use for the past, but I don't have enough of these, so I ended up getting these really cute bags from um, Walmart. But these were the ones that I was originally going to be using um, to put everybody's kit inside. Sorry, y'all. To put everybody's kit inside, and I got this from, again, the vendor. Um, so yeah, but that doesn't really count right now. Um, so these ones are from my company. These are my actual tweezers. So I always put my tweezers inside the kits, but again, everything was so last minute, so I couldn't even use for half of this class or a majority of the class, they don't have my tweezers. So that really sucks, but nothing we can really do about that, you know? Um, but I got some blueberries. And then another water bottle thing. Um, replacement eyelids or whatever. Um, some tape, some glue. And these are the lash trays. So um, everyone in the class get five tray gets yeah. everyone in the class gets five trays. So there are three volume trays and two classic trays. So everyone in the class gets that. Um, I have a pan. Um, what is this? This is their lash mirror. So it basically is like this and it flips and you can look at the bottom, so. But these are, and they will actually come in these bags because I love the bags that they came in, so I'm going to keep them in these bags. Guys, so I'm in my suite right now. Um, It's the next day. So it's, this is our one, this is the third day that I'm here. And um, the suite is basically set up. We do have the paint, so it's not complete yet, but I do want to show you guys how it's looking so far. Um... So I'm going to give you guys a little tour. Oh, wait one second, y'all. All right, sorry, y'all. Um, the maintenance guy had came, so I had to stop recording. Um, that's why it looked so weird. But I'm about to give y'all a tour right now. Um, mind you, like I said before, it's not complete. So don't start judging because it's not complete, y'all. I'm going to start from the hallway. Um, and this is what you see from the outside. And then when you come in, obviously the first thing you see is the receptionist desk. Let me close the door. I wanted to flip the camera around, but I don't know. It was looking a little weird. So first thing you see is the receptionist desk, last shampoos up there, waist trainers. So basically everything looks the same. It's just um scrunched up into like this little suite but um boom receptionist desk boom there and then when you come over we have our waiting area basically literally guys everything looks the same as it did in the last um in the last suite this one is just smaller um we still have our table waist trainers literally right next to the receptionist desk um the only thing about here is that we actually have more rooms, which is pretty good because I'm actually thinking about running rooms out. So if you're in the area, you want a room, hit me up. 
got you. But um, this over here is the lash section. So obviously I'm gonna put like something like nice right there on the wall. Um, I do wanna get a LED light for the flower wall. Um, probably saying just like our logo or our name or whatever. Workstation is over here. Um, that's just how it's looking right now. And then the mirror. And then that right underneath. Okay, so let me go back so I can start at the rooms. I'm all over the place, y'all. Okay, so the reception is this, right? And then this is the first room. So this is my body sculpting room slash wax room um, slash everything else room. So this is what I do in here. Let me turn this off. So I kind of want y'all to understand that this room, none of this stuff is done. This is just what we basically did within a couple hours. <sighs> All right, hold on. Let me put y'all down because, <laughs> sis, my arm, this is why I need to um, hire somebody to do the video stuff. All right, gave my arm a little rest, now I'm back. All right, so the door over here, this is the lip filler station. So um, we do like, fat dissolving, we do Hyaluron Pen Lip Fillers, which is what this is here. So that's this station right here. Over here we have um, waxing, so we do brow wax, but we are getting into vaginal waxes, body waxes. So all this over here is gonna actually change and probably get put on the other side, but I'm not completely sure yet how I'm gonna do the room once I take the course, I don't know. Um, so over here, you guys see our teeth whitening machine. We have all of our teeth whitening things, products, all that stuff is in here. Glasses for both the client and the tech, all that stuff again is there. So nothing on the floor, everything looks clean over there. And that's kind of what it is. Now, when you go on this side, that is just our body sculpting stuff. And as you guys know, our body sculpting and our butt stuff, this is just typical. This is what we do. That thing on the floor down there is the sauna blanket, which is what this is right here that controls this. And these right here, don't mind. These all are coming home with me because during the transition, um, Windex spilled all on them. So all these have to come home with me to get washed. And then, yeah, guys, we have two really huge nice windows brings in a lot of light and i love it all right so this is the first room then we got the second room so the second room um we were kind of contemplating what we're going to do with this room so initially um we were going to rent this room out and the other room for 500 a piece but I'm probably not gonna do that no more because now that I'm saying that I really need most of the space, I'm, I'm probably only gonna rent out one room. This is the room right here. And this is where one of my um, employees work. So this is her body sculpting station. She also does lashes as well. She's still up and coming on the lashes. So she is not offering them yet. She's trying to perfect her craft, which I totally understand. This is the next room. So um, this is most likely gonna be my business room because all my stuff is in here already. And then I'll probably run out um, the middle room and then me and her will share a room. So we'll, cause we're barely here. I'm only three, I'm only here three days a week. She's here once in a while. So we're not gonna like clash or run into each other's schedule. But this is the last room here. And this is all of our lash class stuff for the class we have coming up. So it is literally a mess right now, y'all. But this is the last um, room, I would say. When we get our lash restock, um, they will be going on here. And then when I come in here, I can just grab from the inventory, pack the orders, or I can grab from the inventory and go to the front and give it to the um, person who bought the stuff. 
and then this room right here this is the last room this is the break room obviously it's really really small that's why we made it a break room and that's basically how it looks that is the suite so basically guys that's the suite that's what we're working with right now um i do love it it is way smaller but i don't mind um because it appears bigger you know what i'm saying of everything that i ordered that is here Okay. These are lashes and brushes. Oh, these look so good, y'all. I can't wait till class so that the girls can play with these. They look so good. So, so good. I'm excited. But, um,. I have the last trays all like literally y'all probably ever seen them. They're all on the floor right there, knocked over, but I had them in stacks. So I know what was what. But now I have to go back and put everything in a stack because it messed up. Okay. So I'm doing right now. count these two four six eight ten perfect so i have ten of the point zero three and eighteen the pink bottles but anyways yeah so i'm gonna look for this store if i end up going i'll bring guys with me um if not then this will be the end of this video and i will hopefully see you guys in my next one hope you guys like this video hope you guys like the new suite again it is not done so don't judge it as it looks currently because it's not done yet thank you guys again for watching again i'm excited for the future and i will see you guys in the next one